to another vlog welcome to our channel if you're new don't forget to like comment and subscribe we're about to go to an indoor world park we're super excited about it we went last month so this is Mila's little favorite place to go to so we're going there Mila was also a little preemie I never talk about her preemie journey anymore so I just wanted to bring that up because I know I have some followers that have kids in the NICU so she was born at 23 weeks one pound four ounces she was in the NICU for six months she had a trach, she had a G-tube, she was on a ventilator for a very, very, very long time. So this one right here is a blessing, y'all, a blessing. She went through so much, right? Her trach and G-tube, she wants to go. But her trach and G-tube is now removed, so that is a blessing. Um, Yeah, I could talk to y'all all day about, you know, her little journey and what she went through. I mean, y'all, she went through over bird 20 surgeries, probably more. Um, but yeah, so this is like our autism journey, but I am a previous Nikki mommy. So yeah, I know I speak on it too much, but if you have questions, you can always DM me and ask me. I'm about to go because she's getting antsy. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and welcome to our journey. Y'all, this is so funny because Mila knows how to put her Crocs on, but she went to go put her tennis shoes on, and she almost had it. I'm about to help you though. Hold on. We're back home. I didn't get to record much of anything. It's hard dealing with Mila in the water and then having a camera and then my phone. Next time I'll get a a waterproof case. That's what I said I'm, I am gonna do next time. But we are home. We had a good time. If your kids get overstimulated with crowds, I will wait until summer is over to go. Probably like when school's back in session because it was very much crowded. Um, but we still enjoyed ourselves. Um, I'm about to clean up. I didn't want to get my hair wet, but it was like a lot of kids splashing or whatever. And I know when I was a kid, I used to splash, so I couldn't even be mad. But I got splashed so bad by this one little boy. I think he did it on purpose. But we have Mila here, who's on 10. But we're about to clean up, or I'll clean up in the morning. So either way, y'all see that. We're about to go to a birthday party. We just pulled up. I don't know if I'm going to take my camera in. If not, I'll record from my phone. I just have so much stuff in my hand. And then I have to get the game card and all that. So, yeah, y'all. I'll see y'all when we get in there or after. Oh, y'all. We just got back home. I'm not going to even lie to y'all. I brought my camera in to record. So, I went in at first. And I was like, let me see what it's like and see if I can be able to handle my camera with dealing with Mila. And I was like, okay, cool. Go back out and get my camera. Come back in. But you see me record a little bit of pieces. Um, Mila, you need to come wash your hands with all that soap on it. Thank you. Came back out to get my camera. And they started shooting in the mall. And the place was in the mall. So you know what I did when I seen people running? I asked no questions. Let's go, Mila. <laughs> So, yeah, I, I heard that they were shooting in the mall, but I don't know if, what. I saw police walk, running this way and people running this way. So, we skedaddled too. Here's Mila. I didn't show y'all her outfit, but outfits. Don't wipe your hands off on me. Use a napkin or something. Get a napkin and wipe your hands. Good job. She was so mad we had to leave though, y'all. She didn't understand why. But I was like, you'll thank me one day. <clears throat> Good morning. It is now Sunday and I just rolled out of bed. Groceries were delivered. I'm going out later, so 
Mila is gonna be here. We got some, my camera looks so crooked. Hold on. Hold on, let me see if I can fix y'all up real quick. Yeah, there we go. Um, so we got some spinach. Y'all know Mila loves her spinach. Chickpeas, onions, tomatoes, potatoes, almond butter, ghee butter, some coffee creamer, some fruits, some detergent I already put away. So I'm gonna put this stuff away and then I'm gonna show y'all after I get dressed. It is Sunday, so I'm trying to, she keeps trying to touch my camera. We about to test her. So I'm trying to put this stuff away, y'all. The lighting is so bad. Why is the lighting always bad? Outfit, my boobs are gonna go out. Let's hmm. cover them up. This is the outfit we had to wear all white. Cowboy blue. I'm gonna tighten this up so my boobs won't be still out. But yeah, I gotta go. I'm running late. Good morning. It is the next day. We're about to go to the pool. Bila let her fly in. It's flying all around. Lord have mercy. I'm about to take her to the pool. Hopefully it's not crowded because it's like an indoor pool and it's like camps and stuff are there as well. So hopefully we can get in. Mila's mesmerized with the um with the fly in here. It's 1219 right now. Cheers. So nasty, but it gives me energy. Y'all been eating so bad. I've been eating real, real bad for like the past week. Why do you do this to yourself? I literally been eating, eating, like eating whatever I want when I want it. I've been eating it all. I'm not gonna lie. I went down the path of eating. So y'all know I was doing good. I have to restart. You know that post that be like, I'm gonna start my diet on Monday. That's me restarting every Monday. <laughs> so for me the swimsuit, I typically get these like leotard. It comes with, well I have shorts over top of it, but it's like a one piece. So it can have like her swim diaper and it's comfortable for her as well. But right now she just has on jean shorts on top of it. But I like these better than swimsuits um, if they're not potty trained yet. Cause it kinda, you know, doesn't expose them too much. And I'm dark. And yeah, so I just wanted to show y'all that. Um, you could get it like at the, what is it? The Target section, like the gymnastics section in a way. Um, and they work well. So let me get in the car. I'll talk to you in a little bit. All right, we just got to the pool. You ready, Mila? Thumbs up? Thumbs up. We're about to go in. I'm praying it's not crowded in here, but I got a feeling. I got a huge feeling that it is. But we're about to go in. I'll see y'all in a little bit. Y'all look up at Mila put her baby to sleep. Night night, Marquette. Put Marquette to sleep. Night night. See you in the morning. My camera's blurry. Good morning, y'all. It's a new day. Long day yesterday, long night with Mila, cause who would Mila be if she decides to wake up at four in the morning and now she's asleep and it's supposed to be 11 o'clock. Um, I'm about to clean up real quick and then I am going to take her to the store because I promised her last night. And although she doesn't talk, I think she tries to hold me to my word. And I don't like to back track and not do what I say I'm going to do especially when it comes to Mila so let's clean up really quick
short. Yeah, just for a little bit. But this is how well, it's so crazy because I warmed up her food and everything because I knew. Mom's just now. I'm sorry, y'all. My hair looks like a bird's nest right now. But this is what we got so far. It's not bad. That stuff right there is Mila's stuff that's getting packed. Everything else is pretty fine. And that's what she's about to eat, so. All right, y'all. We spent literally, this is by, like, 30 minutes at the pool. I just got off the shower because I was like, mom. You know when you go to the pool, it's like a whole process. It's like getting them in the pool, taking them out, changing their clothes, drying them off. It's just a whole process. And Mila decided that she wanted to leave after 30 minutes. So that's that. Um, I'm about to show y'all reality of things sometimes when I have to shower with Mila and I have to like wash my hair and stuff. When I am showering with Mila, I put a towel down. This is like the aftermath of everything. She put conditioner all over and then, and then this is my mirror. Um, so I put a towel down. But yeah, so we went to, um, the pool. She didn't stay in there long. But what I was saying is when I have to wash my hair and I know I'm going to be in the shower for a while. I have to put my towel up a towel down and kind of let Mila do some water play because that's the only way she'll stay content. Well, she'll be in my room depending on the mood because if she's in the mood to like relax, then I'll let her stay in the room. But if I know she's in the mood where she's going to get up, she's going to be antsy, then I'll put something down so she could typically have some type of um, water play. But yeah, so the pool didn't last long. Put some hand sanitizer on. She's talking about some no all done. Baby, you're not all done. COVID is back popping. You're just hot outside today? <laughs> Here. But yeah, y'all, so that's that. Vlog all over the place again. I know. Sorry.